Good morning, guys. Let's address this issue of um, police brutality. So, Kenyans have been uh, going on a three day mandamano, and uh, yes, there could be effects of mandamano, but why should a police go to someone's home state and um, beat that person like a child? Somebody can't even call your mother. So, police have been uh, very brutal. Maybe they've been told to do so, but it's not nice even in your jurisdiction as a police you're supposed to protect these people so it's not as if they were even on the streets some were arrested they didn't have any weapons some going to the homesteads and being beaten at the homestead they were not even at, at the sites of the mandamano so why are we really are we really even heading somewhere or we are going backwards to uh, the regime when uh, africans were just being taken into custody for no apparent reason and just being should I say bullied and tortured for what they know nothing about what do we <laughs> I, I don't know I'm even lost for words in this era still police arrest a person without any warrant you're being arrested without even having any carrying any weapon you're go, being beaten in your home not even at the streets where people are protesting what is really happening